with either mechanical type or compression connectors from the pad surface. Thank you for your interest in the Burndy KCKF bulkhead connector. Today, we'll be installing a KCKF onto a metal enclosure with two conductors. Make sure you have all appropriate safety gear, tools, and equipment for the installation. First, consult your Burndy literature to determine the appropriate through hole size for your connector. Remove the cover of your enclosure and drill a hole matching the size of your connector. Disassemble the KCKF as shown. Note the male side and female sides of the connector. Starting with the female portion, place your grounding conductor in the connector and hand tighten under the pressure bar. Next, remove the nut and pressure bar assembly, if necessary, for the male portion of the connection. Install the stainless steel washer, followed by the rubber washer, and insert into the through hole. Hold the male portion in the hole and install the stainless steel washer followed by the stainless steel lock washer. Position the female side with a threaded screw and spin the male side until hand tight. A key component to attaining NEMA 4X rating is tightening the components down to the specified torque ratings. With your Burndy torque wrench, torque the connector to the enclosure using the torque specified in the documentation. Finally, install your external ground connector and tighten to the appropriate torque. Repeat for internal connection. Your KCKF connector is installed. For more information, visit burndy.com. Thank you.